they hit the tree and they, you know, it was, it was, it was bad. A violent morning wake up for residents in this neighborhood after an SUV crashed into this tree, killing at least one. Yeah, we heard a very big, loud um, crash and then we heard squeals like from the tires and I was like, did I just hear that? Early Thursday morning, crews responded to a single vehicle collision in the area of 120th Avenue 88th Street. Many residents woken up in a frenzy from the noise. Others didn't hear anything, but said a crash was bound to happen in that area. We always have people racing up and down the street. They treat it like it's a racetrack. According to EPS, the vehicle was stolen by two men in the area. The owner of the SUV spotted it at a nearby convenience store and started following the suspects from a distance. Shortly after, the vehicle lost control and hit the tree, killing the 27-year-old driver. There is nothing left of it. Like, that's a scary thought. For someone to lose their life so early in the morning and for all our neighbors to witness that. Paramedics treated the 34-year-old passenger and took the man to hospital. According to Edmonton Police, the passenger appeared to have non-life-threatening injuries. We just told him to keep still and because we didn't want them to move around because we don't, it was pretty serious. When the suspect who died in the crash was taken from the vehicle, Trina and Vanessa blessed the body with smudge and said a prayer for the community, saying this affects everyone, including the children at the school around the corner. They were Native people and it was... Um, something that we felt that we needed to do for us and for, you know, that person and their family. EPS Major Collision Investigation Section has since taken over the investigation and EPS say speed is believed to be a factor in the crash. From Edmonton, Adam Zicarelli, City News.